let's say the whole Kingsman cast was thrown into Kingsman training, who do you think would be the one to actually get the job? Not me. Oh. Do you know what? Probably Sophia Batella. I was gonna say Sophia. Huh. Don't mess with Sophia Batella. <laughs> She's the guts of the organization. I'm just the brains. I mean, literally. I see one drop of blood, that is me done. Can you tell me a little bit about your legs in the movie and maybe specifically what they look like on set? They, I had um, leggings, green mm. leggings. Lime and... green. Lime green. Is there anything that they make you do physically while you're on set? Maybe just changing your walk or something? I just had very high heels stilettos. I the remember the first day, the first day I was there, just like, bing, bing, bing. I was like, damn, I couldn't yeah. believe it. So how much of the action in this movie are you guys actually doing yourselves? I'd say like 99%. I mean, everything other than what would mean us risking our lives for I think, insurance purposes, we did. So it probably does, it probably comes to around 90, 95%. So we didn't jump out of a plane. We did do some rather enormous drops from cranes. Mm. That in itself is pretty, pretty scary. Particularly on our first day, I think yeah, that it was, was our first wasn't it? Day. Yeah. Colin, can you tell me a little bit about the church scene? Because I was looking for cuts. I was sure there was going to be something in there, but then I read in the notes that it was one shot. There are sequences that where there have to be hidden cuts because you'll see some of my opponents are the same person over and over again in a different wig or in a guy in a skirt. I didn't catch it. But there is no intercut. So in other words, there's only one camera the whole time. Oh, you know your shit. <laughs>